innovation is about responsiveness to change. Yeah. I'd go further and say it's not just about reacting to change, it's about being able to capitalize on it. It all yeah. boils down to giving people more confidence, yeah. giving the decision makers inside the organization more, more confidence. And big businesses have, have bigger resources, but they also have these dependencies of you know, shareholders yeah. and the welfare of their employees. So you can understand why you know, decision makers at the top of a big corporation, confidence is absolutely everything. When you're looking for evidence of why something might be the right uh, direction to pursue, experimentation can give you that evidence really, really quickly. I would say that experimentation and then the confidence building that experimentation creates is really at the heart of design thinking. One of the things I realized about design thinking is it gives you a superpower the moment you realize that it's okay to be uncertain. And the higher you move up an organization, the more pressure you put yourself under to be able to walk into a room and have the right answer. And what design thinking and experimentation does is to say, of course I'm not going to have the right answer because the future is uncertain, but I've got the right tools that means I can get to the answer really quickly. It will help people become more familiar with failure and use failure more as a learning opportunity, which is something that in organizations is something that we avoid. Failure comes with a big stigma, yeah. but what if we could learn from our mistakes and from trying new things?